The news that five local top stores will be closing is setting in for those who live near those stores. Two of them are located in the Finger Lakes, one in Parenton and two here in Rochester. Emily Noonan joins us now live from the top store on Lake Avenue, which is one of the stores slated to close in November. Emily, what can you tell us about how the loss might impact people there? Well, John, folks in the neighborhood say that Tops is their primary grocery store, and the problem is now is finding transportation to another location. Well, I'm on a bus line, so it's unfortunately it's the only easy way I can get to right now. Mitch Gruber with Foodlink says that's just one of the challenges this community faces. I think we have a, a serious shortage of fresh food availability in this community, uh, pretty much across the city. And what Foodlink tries to do all the time is work with our different members and partners um, to, to provide increased access to fresh fruits and vegetables. So Foodlink came up with a solution. And most notably is our curbside market, which goes all over the city, selling fruits, vegetables, and eggs at reduced prices and actually doubling people's SNAP benefits as well. And though he says their main focus of the curbside markets is public assistance through the SNAP program, it is open to the public. That being said, the shops are only open for one hour at a time. And these curbside markets are located all over the city. There's about 100 of them. One of them is actually located right down the road from this Tops Friendly Markets at Lake Tower. Jeannie, John? Emily, thank you. According to Tops Markets, they plan to close five of the corresponding gas stations, including this gas station on Lake Avenue. The three other locations are local. The gas station associated with the Tops near Witten Road in Rochester will remain open. The stores, along with their corresponding gas stations, are expected to close by the end of November.